control. And that means you're going to have to have good map movements, good side wave control in order to get your advantages. Because you can't simply say, hey, it's time to force and then have an easy force. That being said, Big Vision, his E. And once he gets around level seven, that's where the laning phase gets easier. We got to talk about this top lane. What did we say? Smithy going top early. Flame already in combat. Nick Smithy coming up. Also he goes as for the trade. Level two, Ezreal. Great rock today from Solus with the pillar. He's going to force the flash out. Tagged already by the red buff. Nick Smithy still going flame. Flash is forward and Immortals going to grab first blood. The Fnatic know they have numbers on top side. Flame definitely going to be the target. And there's no teleport from Pobelter this game around, so he is 1v3. Caps goes in, he's got the level 6, he flashes early with the flash on bar from Broxer is there, Caps. He's gonna try and get himself a kill with the south into the suppression, Caps! For a pick. Cody Son looking for something here, but Pobelter could be the first pick off, Caps lets the ultimate rip, Broxer lines up the knockup there and silence to death, Caps! Charging at Cody Son. Oh no, oh no, Broxer is gonna land a wild group, maybe not enough, the execute from Broxer not there, but the feast not need a Broxer grabs the kill, and now Caps in onto LA, look at the silence team, that's so much damage from this Malzahar, the shield, not there, Caps snipes Ole with a kick. Check this Malzahar and Trogath, and Reckless is more than enough insurance for these fights. Cody lets it go with the ultimate, flash fill there from Flame, trying to start something. The root onto Caps is not enough damage as Soez again moves back through. Reckless getting aggressive, jumps forward towards the waters, and Soez just eats Ole, gets the kill. Cody caught by a rupture, that's gonna be it, Fnatic! Push through, take down the Nexus, and look to make world's history as they go up against once more the Gigabyte Marine. Look at the smiles on Fnatic faces. They defy expectations. They're going to take down Immortals and keep their quarterfinal hopes alive. Only one left there as the Nexus goes down Immortal to play. Very clean game overall from Fnatic. You look at the early draft and there is so much behind. He does all these things, but then one big play from Fnatic in the top side where they kill Cody Sun, they kill Ole without their flashes, very quickly translates into a Baron, and then there's nothing that Immortals can do to stop the relentless pressure from Fnatic.